I read that uh, last night was the first time you'd seen the movie. Yeah, is it that was. true? Yeah, yeah. It, for same myself. For you? What's that? No, I, I'd seen it before. Oh, okay, so what, what were your thoughts on it? I Even loved it, time. and it's really cool to see, you know, it's a bigger production valued movie, and it's mm-hmm. just really cool to, to see that come to play. The wolves were really more intense, which I liked, um, and the production value, it, you yeah. could just see that the difference, and I love Twilight and what Catherine did, because that yeah. felt really edgy and independent-like, which I loved, um, but then seeing what David did, I mean, let alone the book is more mature and darker and mm. more, um, more more edgy, I guess. Uh, but, yeah, uh, the movie's an action-packed movie, yeah. and I, I really love that. It is. It's definitely one for the guys this time around yeah. as well. And I'm sure with all that fight training, fight sequences, there must have been some injuries, some mishaps during filming. Well, <laughs> Kellen, Kellen punched someone in the head, and then I got punched in the head. <laughs> I, let's, let's, let's cut those lines. I did not punch Nikki in the head. Someone else probably did. I hit Jackson on you accident. You hit Jackson and knocked him out. Yeah. Oh, really? And then and Peter professionally like hit me and, like... I was like, really? oh yeah, totally. We were we what were a doing. Woman beater. You were jumping over actually and and attacking Victoria in that in that scene. Peter was describing something to the director, and because of these contacts, we don't have any peripheral vision. Oh my God, and he like swung his arms open and clocked me right in the forehead, and I was like dizzy, and I went to go sit down. And he kept talking like he didn't even realize he did it. And then later on, someone said like, you realize you just hit Nikki, and Peter was like, oh my God, I thought that was a tree. <laughs> it just happens. So obviously your your strength that your your yeah strength in fighting is your strength. What's uh, Rosalie's strength in the battle scenes? Being dead sexy. I mean, <laughs> oh, she just kills newborns with her stare. It's great. <laughs> um, Look at that God, smile. you're so outrageous. <laughs> um, I um, you know, I, I I actually think that her um, physical mm-hmm. strength and uh, emotional strength is sort of her yeah her power. We also get to see your backstory in this, mm. which is so nice that they left it in. So how important is it for us to see that about your character? Um, I, I think it sort of it really contributes to the to the film um, for a number of different reasons. Um, you know, the obvious, which is that you sort of understand like mm-hmm. her behavior and, and yeah. where she's coming from. But I think that it adds like you know sort of a, a depth and an understanding of the whole family all around because you understand like where or. I guess the severity and the seriousness of of, uh, of what Carlisle did in, in changing all of these people without their consent, you know, and, and I think yeah. that brings up like an, a lot of issues. <laughs> we don't have any Emmett backstory. Is there any chance there that maybe happened? There I is, mean, though. I mean, they just I mean, never. No. It's not. It's not placed in the books. There's excerpts yeah. in, on Stephanie's website, and and I'd really love to show our more of our relationship yeah. because it's very key and you get to see a lot of Alice and Jasper mm-hmm. but uh, it'd be really fun to show us maybe in the next one you know probably know. well I'd show more of us in yeah. the next one um, just because her relationship with Bella in the book is a lot yeah. you know it's larger and of course Emmett's there to listen to his <laughs> wife yeah Emmett here Emmett's there to take orders <laughs> So I know you haven't, I believe they're still working on the script for it. Is there anything that is in the book that you really hope they're going to leave in for your characters? Well, um, I mean, they've done, to be honest, like the, the studio and Melissa, the, they've done a really amazing yeah. job of, of staying true to the books, and I don't really feel like anything has been left out. I mean, it's sort of the key to the success of the films yeah. is staying true to the books because clearly the books are what people love. Um, and that's why I believe they made the decision to make it into two movies, that they don't leave anything yeah. out. 